we're AUHS Media, uh, which is actually uh, an arm of American University of Health Sciences. Uh, we're here today at Comic-Con. Uh, after almost two years, actually two years of not having an international Comic Con, we're here in San Diego. And we have a chance to actually talk to people about God, have a chance to talk to people about uh, what it means to be a true hero, and a chance so that we can uh, tell people about the different things that we're doing in, in, uh, in the university and in our programs. Flower is a comic book that centers actually around my daughter, Alexandria. And it talks about someone who actually fights against uh, uh, sex trafficking among children. Um, and it's a great opportunity for uh, people to understand that this is a real thing that takes place in the world. And while it's heinous, while it's evil, uh, it's still kept in the down low. And it's really, really caustic in terms of the impact that it has upon children uh, and the souls of children. So it's not something that we should act oblivious to. It's something that we should address and correct. Well, some people ask constantly, you know, why we would be here at Comic-Con. Well, you have a whole generation of people that actually, and, and young people that are actually interested in this space. Uh, they come to cosplay, they come to enjoy, and they come to escape oftentimes the reality of their own existence. Um, so our presence here goes back uh, 10 or 15 years. Uh, and we're gonna continue to uh, be engaged in Comic-Con because it is a place where people can dream. It is a place where people can see their dreams become reality, and we want to support that while we're telling them that God is real, while we're telling them that Christ died for them, and while we're telling them that God has rose from the dead for their sins and for their salvation. Oh, it's so amazing. We've had a chance to pray for a lot of people today. Uh, young people that were praying for their families and their loved ones. Uh, kids that wanted to pray for their parents. Uh, parents that wanted to pray for their children. You know, uh, people that were feeling lost and feeling afraid and feeling uh, overwhelmed uh, where we could encourage them. And that's what this is all about. You know, what are you doing to bless people? What are you doing to make a difference? What are you doing to, to help people understand that God has not left them and that God is real and they should still have hope because God will never let them go. Will never, ever let them go.